Hello everybody, this is Aquatamia and we are back today with The Sims 2 ABC Legacy. It's part 18 and you've got to get up soon and go to work. And you are getting up. And you've got to, well, you could go to work 10 to 5. And you should probably be the one to take care of the baby. No, I want to pick the baby up. Well, I guess the nanny's going to do it then. Uh, why don't you go practice some? So you don't go to work until nine now. No, so y'all both go at nine. And you still go at eight. Okay. made a slight change to the kitchen which added one more well it added two more cabinets but one of them was a corner cabinet so I don't know that that counts so it added one more cabinet I don't know if I like it better or not I need to do some upgrades in the kitchen but you know yeah I know Okay, there goes Blaze letting the world know that he wants his diaper changed, Miss Kendall. Since we are paying you to be here, you might as well do your job. Carpool will be here in an hour. I think I'm going to send him to work. I think it'll be okay. He's in real good shape right now. Oh, spring. Okay, you can't tell it from the snowflakes, but it's spring. Aileen likes nature. We're going to grow a garden. And try to get into the garden club, which will be practically impossible on this lot, unless we spend God knows how much money on plants. Because this lot is ginormous. So the amount of plants that we would have to have, ginormous. We could put a garden over here. Uh -huh. Instead of putting it in front yard, we could put it over here somewhere. Dude, you gotta get up and go to work. You are going to also have to get up. We'll have you walk to work. Dude, your ride's here. Corey, find your ride's here. Ten best friends. We'll work on it for you. There you go. General Bigfoot, off he goes. Into the wild blue yonder. Dum da dum. Da 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 dum. Oh, 
And she's gonna play piano. Oh, we got paid ninety six dollars for bills. Yeah, because we have the two. We don't have a lot of green energy production, but we got the two. Adam could really use the grant money offered by the London Scholarship for immense brains, but he hadn't hasn't published a paper in quite some time. There are a few topics of interest about which he could write, most notably the effects of the vegetables on the sim psyche and frostbite, a world without toes. Both subjects are quite compelling and would make excellent papers. So it's easy decision. So it isn't an easy decision. What subject should Adam write about to win the so the effect of vegetables? I'm just gonna go with the effect of vegetables. Eating healthy and, the, uh, and Sims well-being are huge topics throughout the community, which makes the effect of vegetables on the Sims psyche an obvious choice for Adam's paper. After hours of detailed research, Adam feels he has enough material to present a fantastic paper. Unfortunately, Donald, Donald Summerby, another talented professor vying for the grant, presents his paper, Celery and You, How Peanut Butter Will Change Your Life, to a greater acclaim. Adam never had a chance against the deliciousness of celery combined with peanut butter. Worse, he has been demoted to high school principal for failing to win the grant. Well, shit. Can he go right back to work? If we walk to work now, you know what? I'm not even gonna do it. I'm not even gonna do it. I'm just not gonna do it. Come on inside and use the bathroom. <sighs> My fault. Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. Are you having a baby or are you having a miscarriage? You better not be having a miscarriage. Oh no. Oh no. Original number. Okay, we're just having a baby. A human skin baby? It's a baby girl. Why doesn't it not look like an alien? At all. Why does it not show who you're... It doesn't show the... I, Is this because I installed in team? Is this gonna happen to all of my alien babies? It's lost its genetics. It's alien genetics. It's supposed to be an alien baby and it's lost its alien genetics. And it just shows one parent. Well, that sucks. Um, little girl, I was thinking since the baby can't be the heir, that we would give it an A name. Because, like, Adam, and then... I was, that's what I was thinking. Anyway, I don't know what we're gonna name her. Uh, hold on. I've got... I can't believe we lost the alien DNA. Because that means I'm going to lose alien DNA on all my sims that are pregnant right now. And all my DNAs are going to be all screwed up. And I'm not real, real big fan of that. But it's my fault. I'm the one who put the sim in. Um... so bummed. Um, Alicia, Alfreda, Alice. Nothing is jumping out at me.
could do Amara. Or we could do Ming. Hmm, nothing is popping out at me. It's because I'm distressed. Because I know how many Sims I've got right now who are pregnant with alien babies, and it's upsetting me. Oh, well. I think we're going to name her Amara. Okay, we'll name her Amara. And we need another. I'm so bummed about this. Makes me want to get him alien abducted again so we can have an actual alien baby. I haven't had an alien born with this new skin pack. I hope it's not anything in the skin, in the, um, mod that is causing the problem. So this baby should be a gray-eyed, red hair, light-skinned baby girl. She's going to look just like her daddy, but be a girl. Because she's got no other genetics. We'll play with Amara. Hmm. Fetal the bottle to Amara. Cuddle Amara. And put Amara in the crib. We're also going to have to get some toddler. Oh, uh, we can't. If I put them like this, we're not going to be able to separate the, them out by room. We could do one big square and put the two babies in one square. Um, so depressed now. I I was looking so forward to a little green haired little green skinned baby. That'd make them in one room. And then Oh, I've got a window there. Oh, man. You can't even with move objects on, you can't put the... <sighs> Do I have a half window anywhere that I can steal and switch? Okay, where's the half window? We'll put two right there. And then we will buy some toddler beds. Um, can't get this one in white though. I, that, this is my favorite toddler bed, but it doesn't come in white. And what I need to do is take the time to look around and see what else I could find that I would like better because I have not shopped for CC for The Sims 2 in an age. It has literally been years. What is on that? It's actually kind of pretty. Um, that wasn't what I was looking for, but okay. I was looking for the covers that would match because I know I have some covers that match we could do it with the yellow
Okay. That takes up most of the room. With the two beds. And then we have this. And then we'll just have to put... We don't need... We can put... Up there. Sure. I'm just a little sad. Because I've got so many pregnant Sims that are going to have human babies that are clones of themselves. It just makes me sad. This is what you get when you go messing around with mods. Sometimes it does things you did not plan on. Oh, that one is being used. Use the bathroom. And I got him demoted. All on the same day. I'm I'm just striking out all over the place. Oh well. Uh, makes me want to get him alien abducted again. But at the same time, that would give two babies that aren't eligible to be heir. And Ellen has been promoted to vice president. Yay! And she brought a friend home with her. And she wants to plant a garden. Buy an orchard tree. Oh, we're not ready to buy an orchard tree yet. Hey, Gordon. Um. Call Sam. Let's see if we can call Neri. Okay. You want to vote? Y'all both want orchard trees? But neither of you know enough to take care of an orchard tree. So we could. We do have room enough for an orchard out here. We could put little orchard trees out here and two things of vegetables. Then we'd probably need to hire a gardener to help us with it. How much space do we have for, let's see, if we buy an orchard tree, I mean, we might as well buy one of each, but here's an orange tree. put four if we do it that way. I don't know if we want that many. Um, okay, okay. put we haven't even painted our house have we I was gonna say what color is our house but no we haven't even painted our house let's get the brown ones that I like these brown ones petrified wood stone flooring I like these I think they look good in a garden too mm. 
Now, do we put them going all the way down? Mm, how are we going to space the trees? That would leave two of them in the center closer together than the other two. Would that bother me? Because I was thinking of putting one here. That would be here. Here. No. Here. And here and we would have three. We would only have three. Put a lemon tree right there. An apple tree right there. We can still put this around here. What are we putting in those spots? I don't want to put another tree. Do we just cover them? I just spent a lot of money on this, didn't I? Well. It has to be done. Bigfoot is home. You want to plant a seed? Does he bring Marissa home with him every single day? I mean, geez. We know Andrea. Oh, he gave, they gave us a lounge chair. Uh, I think I'm going to pass on that one. She, why is the nanny back? It's like the nanny dropped her off and then came back and, is it because you changed hours? Oh, you work eight to four now. Okay. All right, what do you want in this world? You want 10 best friends. Which you do not have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Actually, you could. Answer that for me. You've got one more friend that could get you. No. Yes, we'll do that. Okay. Let's go start working on the garden. Oh, your son's about to age up. Mm. Let's go ahead and take off your thinking cap. <laughs> what are you doing? He needs his diaper changed. Oh my god. Change his diaper. She's got this for the moment. Um, you need to eat. Here, pull that out. 
come and grab a plate. And then she can Agent Blaze. Aging. Agent Blaze. in his little skull cap and of course she wants to have another baby yeah you do look kind of like your dad not unexpected he's got all his dad's coloring so you he ought to have more of your features then because that's usually the way it works your mouth your nose yeah, he may have your ears. I can't tell about his ears because he's got a cap over him. So I don't know if he's got the pointy ears or if he doesn't have the pointy ears. Okay. Let, let us get you to come here and make some smart milk. Mama's gonna make you a bottle. Just give her a minute. No, no, no. Did I not just say wait for a minute? You go ahead and drink that. You make one more bottle. Okay. Uh, oh, I guess I have enough for a couple people to eat. He wants to be potty trained, but that's not going to happen. She wants to teach him a nursery rhyme, of all things. Do, do me a favor and use the bathroom first. Why do I keep changing sims? And then you can teach him a nursery rhyme if that's what you want to teach him. Food stuff is low. I may just replace the... I just may just replace the... Oh, you've decided to cook. Dude. Some cooking, dude. Don't serve it. <laughs> He's tired, but he needs to learn some logic for work, and okay, I admit that I want him to get out of the abducted, but he probably won't, but we'll send him out there to do that. Mm. 
Then we're gonna have to get this. She doesn't have any. Oh, she's got a gold sales badge. Baby. He needs some aspiration. Alright, he wants to sing a nursery rhyme with you. So let's let's put place here and then sing a nursery rhyme with him. Tickle him. And then you might as well talk to him because it's the only thing we haven't done. Oh, now he doesn't want to do that. And then you can try to potty train him a little bit. There you go. What are you doing? Are you stuck? You are stuck. Okay, do you have gardening badge? You do have a gold gardening badge. Hmm. Hmm. Go work on the garden trees for me since you have a gold gardening badge. Go in there and play. You have not eaten, but that's fine. I want you to come out here and fertilize. You can play for just a little bit, then you gotta go to bed. Okay. I kinda like some eggplants. But then again, I never use eggplants when I grow them. I mean, they're great. But usually I just stick whatever I get in the fridge. I don't even use the blender or uh, the juicer that much. So I don't know if it's any point in me growing eggplants when I could just grow tomatoes. Oh, the other baby, Amora, is crying. There you go. Oh. Okay, sweetie, you need to go to bed. Oh. What time do you go to work tomorrow? You go to work at 8. Okay, come change them. Come change Amora's diaper. 
Did you get any of your logic up? I think he was almost about to get a logic point up. Okay, that's all right. Um, play with Amora. Feed a bottle to Amora. Put Amora. Let's put Amora back in that crib. up and go to sleep. Yeah, I'll, I'll deal with the food stock at some point. He's getting the trees up. Sweetie, you do have work tomorrow, so I don't know that we're going to get these planted today. It's going up. It's not there, but it's going up. <laughs> okay, and who's going to help the baby tonight? The toddler. He made it to bed. He's made it to bed. He's got the most energy. She's going to have to go to bed. So when he gets up, <clears throat> we need somebody to make some more bottles. Somebody's going to have to get up and help him with Mm. I got you a bottle. Oh, there's your aspiration pump. There we go. I guess you your first little. three in the morning. There you go. Get you some bottle. She's headed to bed. He's still working on the trees. And it needs to be sprayed again? Might need to put some Bee houses? What? Ladybug houses? That's what I'm going for. Ladybug houses. Um, between the trees. That would look good. And maybe they'll keep the trees from getting as buggy. Okay. He's decided to go play, even though he has level two. Why did you roll out of potty? Uh, I thought I had potty locked. Alright, sure. Did you go to bed? You did go to bed. Anyway, guys, I think we're going to end this part right here. So thank you so very much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed, and I hope that I'll see you back here again real soon. Bye for now, guys.